Rejoice, rejoice, Emmanuel shall come to thee, O Israel. Welcome to Day 17. This is my very, very prized Nativity Crash. This is the one that sits over our fireplace at my house. And I brought it to show you. It's from Africa. And there's Joseph. It's carved from black wood. And here's Mary. I think she's beautiful. And my favorite part is look at baby Jesus. He comes out of his manger. Look how cool he is. Look how cool his carving is. Mr. Gilliam bought this for me one year, and it's very special to me. I thought while we're looking at my favorite crush that we would read this funny story. It says, who is coming to our house? Now look at, look at the cover of this book and tell me what you think it's going to be about. Hmm. Who is coming to our house? to our house. Someone, someone, says the mouse. There's the mouse. She is announcing to all the animals, someone is coming to the house. Make room, says pig. I will butt aside the rig. Look, the goat is moving the wagon. We must clean, says the lamb. Dust the beams, says the ram. They're getting everything cleaned up. Who is coming to our house? Someone, someone, says the mouse. Sweep the earth, says the chick. Stack the hay, says goose, and quick. Spin new webs, says the spider. I will line the crib with eider. Eider are the teeny tiny little soft feathers on the front of a, of a little duck. Who is coming to our house? Someone, someone, says the mouse. Someone's coming from afar. Now if you take a peek right here in this picture, you can sort of see who the owl sees. Can you see who the owl sees that's coming from very far away? Kind of see it. I will nose the door ajar. Oh, the horse is opening up the door. says Cat. They'll never come, says the Rat. Yes, they'll come, says Mouse. Someone's coming to this house. Oh boy, the Mouse is up on top of the horse, the cow's head. I will lay an egg, says Hen. I will spread my tail for them. Ooh, a bright peacock tail. Who is coming to our house? Whoa, Mary and Joseph, says the mouse. Welcome, welcome to our house. All those animals welcomed baby Jesus to the stable. And there's the bright star in the sky. Tonight we're going to add another nail to our Advent tree. And I'm going to read you this Bible verse. It says, Jesus was despised and rejected by men 
Like one from whom men hid their faces, he was despised, and we esteemed him not. That Bible verse is talking about when the, when the people were really angry about Jesus, and they didn't want him to be telling people about heaven anymore and about forgiveness, and they were really angry. And Jesus kept telling the people that he was God and that they needed to listen to him. But they didn't want to listen to Jesus. So they pushed him aside and they hurt Jesus. And he wasn't even recognizable anymore. And so we didn't hold Jesus to his great honor that he deserved. Because, because we needed him to go to the cross. That's why. So I'm going to invite my family to come. I'm going to clean up a little bit, and then I'm going to invite the kids to come back in and sing with us today and, and pray with us. I think maybe we should sing Away in a Manger, since our story was about all those animals today. <clears throat> that story reminds me of the song Away in a Manger. Should we sing that one? Away in a manger, no crib for a bed. The little Lord Jesus lay down his sweet head. The stars in the sky looked down where he lay. The little Lord Jesus asleep on the hay. Daddy, will you sing for, or would you pray for us sure. today? Lord Jesus, thanks for being born in a smelly staple. Amen. Amen. Amen.